Welcome to BlackstoneBass.com, where the bite is on. Hey, today I'm working on this 99 2000 uh, bass tracker panfish. You've seen I've done a lot to the engine so far. Well, my live well's broken. I have to carry this bubbler with me when we're fishing the tournaments, and that's not working out too well. So I'm gonna show you the issue with my live well. I tried to look up some things online. Uh, I couldn't really find a lot, so I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna try to fix mine. If you look in here, a lot of these bass tracker live wells are alike. Uh, I don't have any kind of pipe that comes out that shoots the bubbles. So all I have is a drain pipe here. I don't know if you can see that on the film there. There you go. I <clears throat> so as you can see, the water flows in here like a big water hose with no end on it. And what will happen is it will fill the live well up until it overflows into the boat. It won't drain fast enough. So I looked online. I even called Bass Pro Shops. So I couldn't find the right part. I wasn't sure. So... Anyway, I ended up finding this place online. I'll put a link. It's uh, Great Lake Skipper. I'll put a link down in the description. So I looked at what I thought I needed and I ordered this pipe here. And as you can see, this get a little close up. It probably fits right on that same uh, screw and I'll show you how to get to that. It's got a little adjustment on the end so you can uh, give you aerating bubbles and adjust your water flow so it won't fill up the boat. I know that uh, my live well here is its own container but it's the same setup on a lot of bass trackers, even though it might be a live well in the floor. So we'll see. <clears throat> okay, like I said, a lot of these uh, live wells are, have the same type of setup. Uh, you might be in the bottom of the floor somewhere, but it's made to come in this pipe here. It's supposed to have some kind of end on it that'll make it aerate and not fill up too fast. And then it's supposed to drain out of this pipe right here. So you should have a way to access the back of this uh, pipe here, this elbow, and mine has this plate cover right here. So if you can pull the cover off or however you can access yours, so I get the camera down there, the seat's in the way. There it is. So you need to get something to take this hose clamp off, and I should be able to uh, put the new piece in if I can get that loose. So let's see if I can get that now. Can't seem to get any slack on it uh, from the other side. I can't get a ratchet or a screwdriver on it. Let me see if I can take this nut off right here and uh, give it some slack to where I can get to the other side easier. And that should help. I'm gonna be able to turn the pipe some anyway. You see that looks like the same piece right here. So hopefully this will work. Gives me a little more flexibility. I can take that out and turn. That should help me right there. All right, I got it turned a little bit. I can get the end of a screwdriver on it. It's not the best, but it's trying to work. Maybe I can get a ratchet on there now. Got to move it around. It was turning with the screwdriver. Okay, the best solution that I found was to pry this out a little more with one screwdriver if I'm not blocking the camera and then turn it with the second screwdriver pry it up so you can see it and undo it with this other screwdriver when I put it back on you can bet I'm gonna put it where I can get to it if I can ever get it off now I should be able to, yeah, you can see the pipe the clamps loose now I should be able to get this off of this piece hopefully not really a lot of room in the boat to get a bend work and then on the ground it's a little long of a reach even though I got long arms it's so tight inside here if I get this out all the way out ah oh, there we go now I can get some room to maneuver Almost got it now. I got it broke loose. As you can see, I can spin it. <sighs> oh, there we go. Old one's out. Okay, I got the old one off, and you see this O-ring here is dilapidated for the years of use. Um, so the new one. 
you got two two ring two rubber rings you want to take this bolt off right here this nut excuse me it comes out and you want to put one of these little washer o-rings sealers on this side of the live well and then you put the other one on when you put this other bolt on on the other side of the live well but the wall goes right here so see if we can't get this on now I got the new pipe here, putting it down on there. I guess I need to go through the hole first. Straps in the way, can you see that? I already got the pipe through the hole. I'm trying to do this without dropping this other piece. Trying to go on there, it's not much room. Plier, see if I can pull up on that hose. Don't forget my washer. nut take the pliers want to snug it up a little bit not have it too bad but at least snug it up double check this side here make sure I'm good if I need to get back to that I can it's all on there, everything looks good. I did donate one uh, little socket down in the hole, but I don't want to take up the whole live way to get to it, so I'll just have to give me another quarter inch socket. So now to add the finishing pieces. This piece right here, a little aerator to adjust the water and how much comes out. Come on out a little bit. So we need to get it to the lake and test her. There's the plug. See if that see if that does the job or not. Hopefully this works. We'll see. We'll test it out on the lake. Okay, as you can see, I'm back at it. Uh today that drain tube, it was just a hair high because the water would have to get so high that it was still trying to splash out of the live well before it would drain down the tube. So I'm just gonna take about a half an inch off, uh no more, to this drain tube and then try it again. Uh, Tomorrow, go out there and see what it'll do. There we go. Let's see. Let's see what she'll do now. The boat and you can see I cut that pipe off of almost a half an inch, and it seems to be doing fine. I might need to turn the water down just a notch. But she's going down the pipe and she's holding right there. The live well is working, and the bite is on. How you like that big boy? Got some nice fresh bubbles for you. The bite is on, baby.